Okay, attempt number two at this video. Hi, YouTubers and subscribers. I'm coming to you with a video on jewelry. Um, we can get so many great items at the thrift store, and I find a lot of statement pieces and jewelry of all kinds there that I just absolutely love. So I wanted to share that with you. Um, this haul is mostly necklaces, and I tried to take this once before, and it got a little too long. It was going into like 15 minutes that's too long for me so I'm trying to narrow it down so this is my second attempt at narrowing it down hopefully there won't be a third okay I'm going to start with this piece here and I'm hoping that this white clutch will bring it out more I can tell you that most of the jewelry that I'm going to show you none cost over $2.99 and if it did I will mention that I decided a lot of these paint pieces were just odd to me and statement pieces, so I got them. I'm doing this as quickly as possible. I love this piece. Goes with a lot. And that's the black detailing up there. Simple but elegant on so many dress things. I'm into the beads lately and they go with so many things and so easy to clean and keep in good condition. Sorry about that. This is a piece that I love and when I got this I was like thrilled to death. And I don't remember the exact price of it but I do know it was not over $2.99 but look at that. That's an elephant with the horn up. Oh that is so gorgeous. Have to love that. Recent purchase tag seal on it that I purchased it for dollar ninety nine cents. So you know I haven't worn it if I still have the tag seal attached to it. Another that I paid about a dollar ninety nine cents for. And that's a lime green and orange. And God, is this gorgeous! Simple beaded necklace. Another beaded necklace that I love. This is a piece that I bought years ago. That's silver on a black cord. This too is on a cord. Got that Aztec feel to it. The blues. Red. This is a silver one, and I don't have a lot of silver, so you won't see a lot of silver. But this is silver with some black and clear glass beading with some brown and black stones on the inside of that. I love this piece. Goes with so much gives me that color of interest when I wear it. These are pieces that I actually purchased from different places. Um, Avon. Excuse me. Rue 21. It's on a very long chain. This is thrifted. I can't remember where I got this from, but I think I purchased it. Of course, off a clearance track somewhere because I don't believe in retail playing full price. And it came with earrings. These are pieces that I've had for a number of years. And when I say a number of years, I really mean a number of years. But they're on cords also, so they can be changed at any time once they go bad. But I got these from Palm Beach Troy. At the time, crosses were in. And um, I was looking for some pieces that could actually be seen instead of the smaller ones that I had. And these worked out just fine because black and silver is one and brown and gold is the other. 
So, matches everything in my closet. This is a recent, recent purchase, excuse me, from JC Penny. One of my thrift store finds that I get compliments on every single time I wear it. And it is so old now, but I get compliments every single time I wear it. This is a piece I recently got. That doesn't want to add right now that I'm trying to show it. Um, it's on a gold chain. That's white enamel with a little pearl on the inside. I think this was one of my Avon purchases. You know, when they had the set for like $7.99 or less, $5.99, earrings go with it. This is one of my gifts, I call it, from the thrift store that I frequent quite a bit. This was brand new. Still has the original tag on it. It says it's sterling silver. It was $39.99 originally. Um, the Goodwill that I go to had it marked for $19.99. Um, I want to say that day they had so much stuff I liked and stuff. I might have spent like 60 or 80 bucks in there that day. So they actually gave me this. Um, the ladies are really nice and they see me all the time. And when I'm not, when, I, when they don't see me for a month or more, when they do see me, they wonder where I've been, have I been sick or something. <laughs> That's how much I go to that one. Um, I also have this piece here. Oh, Lord. Why when you make a video, it's nothing more to stand up right or sit up right or hang right. And that's just a simple piece. It's starting to turn a little bit, but I still love it. It's on a cord also. I love the cords because the cords can be changed out when they start to rival and everything. So I love that. And I'm going to check my time right quick. These videos are so long sometimes and they go so quick. You don't realize how much time you spent. And I don't have a timer yet to let me know where I've met, you know, my limit. I really hope y'all enjoy these videos that I show myself on. I don't do a lot of talking about random things yet. Um, but I just basically like to show my things that I get because oh the amazing finds I see other people get and then I realize just how amazing my finds are as well. This is on a long chain. Still has the price tag on the way I purchased this one for two sixty nine. And I think you can actually get these at some place like Forever Twenty One or Route Twenty One, something like that. Another piece. It has fur balls on it. Wasn't kind of fond of the fur balls, but once I wore it with the outfit, it was like knockout. So I love it. Longer jewelry seems to be in with shorter necklaces and stuff, so that's why I got a few of these pieces. And when I say a few, I probably got about five total that's on really long chains. Just to keep up with the trends. This is another piece I get a lot of compliments on. It's a leaf. Rust colored oranges, those fall colors, and then this part here it's a light, pale, peachy color with some golden on it. It is absolutely gorgeous, and I get a lot of compliments on this one as well. I bought this piece only because 4th of July is coming up, Memorial Day, and I think this piece would be great. Red, white, and blue. I'll try to show an outfit of the day once I wear this with it, whatever I decide to put it on with. Orange one. And that is orange. That is, I just got it because it's orange. I recently bought another bracelet that I'll show you. Um, that's the same orange, but I got it from a different store. This came from the Goodwill that came from um, Rue 21 bracelet did. And I'll show that in the next one. And I'm going to show these last three pieces because I want to get those in. And then anything else I'll show in another video. But look at that. For you ladies who love the odd and the different. Isn't that beautiful? I almost slept on this piece and I saw it at the last minute as I was already ringing up my purchases. And here's another one I absolutely love. It was so thrilled when I found this. Look at that. Isn't that different and gorgeous? Who wouldn't want that? 
I love this. And the last piece for now is um, the purple. And it's nothing big and basic about it. But it's it's kind of ho oh hum, but I love it. It's just dark purple, and I don't wear much purple, but this is a good piece for the bright and colors or something that might be dull. And so I'm gonna end that video right here because, uh, like I said, I have a tremendous amount of stuff, but I like my videos to be a certain length and try not to over exceed that. So I think this is a good place to stop. And if I come across any that I kind of wanted to show and didn't show, I'll show them with my next um, jewelry haul because there are more. I know I have more um, earrings and bracelets I want to do. I don't get many rings, um, but I'll have a few rings, but it won't be many rings. But um, earrings will be a tremendously, it may have to be broken out into two parts, but I hope not because I'm going to fly through that also. I hope you enjoyed my necklace haul. Um, leave your comments at the end of the video. Um, I'm, I'm really acceptable to any comment. Um, if you're not a subscriber, I hope you like the video and subscribe. And if you are a subscriber, thumbs up for the support. <laughs> Isn't that so geeky? Thumbs up. But um, love you guys and see you in the next video.